Hi, y'all. This is Genevieve with Belly Down and Moonbeams. How are y'all doing? I'm doing well, and today I'm going to talk to you about apples. Yes, apples. Apples is an edible fruit produced by an apple tree. Duh. And apple trees are grown across the world. The ancestor of the apple tree was found in Central Asia, where its ancestor um, is still found. So, apples have religious and mythological significance in many cultures, including Norse, Greek, Christian, and witchcraft. If you cut the apple open at its widest point around, you will discover that a five-pointed star resides within. At the end of this, I'm going to show you a picture of it, of one that I've cut. But I'm going to have to go cut it in a second. When you do that, um, in some traditions, you can even use apple seeds as part of your spells. This, this five-pointed star, though, symbolizes a pentagram. Yeah. Um, this apple is used in spells for fertility, prosperity, love, healing, fidelity, beauty, vanity, wisdom, the soul, karma, the afterlife, immortality, and poppet magic. So it's a wide variety. You can pour apple cider into the ground before you plant to give the earth life. And that's what was always said. But if you think about it, it makes the ground more acid, so it's able to grow better. The deities associated with apples are Freya, Aphrodite, Venus, Dionysus, Apollo, Athena, Diana, and Zeus, to name a few. There's tons of them out there. And the holidays associated with the apple are Maybon and Samhain. The apple is considered a feminine um, de entity. The planet is Venus, and the sign is Taurus. So, I'm gonna go take a picture now, and I'll see you in another day or two. You cut the it around, not up and down. See, not this way, but this way. And see, this is how it comes out. See the five-pointed star?